Astonishingly, two-thirds of child car seats checked at fitting clinics are either the wrong child car seat for that child or are fitted incorrectly. So it's essential that you buy the right one and you get it fitted properly to really protect your little one. Firstly, make sure you check the child car seat fits in your car before you buy. If it doesn't, then it may not protect your child in a crash. You'll also need to check it fits in any other cars you might use. Take a look at our buying video for more advice on how to choose the best. You should ask the retailer that you're buying the child car seat from to demonstrate the fitting for you and you should practice it yourself before you take it home. The safest place for the child car seat is always on the back seat of the car. All child car seats are fitted slightly differently, so make sure you read the instruction manual before you fit it. The child car seat should sit squarely and evenly on the base of the seat. If it doesn't, then it's the wrong one for your car and you'll need to get another. To fit this type of child car seat, you need to follow the blue route guides to loop the seat bolt around it. Start by pulling the seat belt out to make it easier. Then you want to pull the lap part of the belt through the blue route guides making sure it's secure and then placing it into the buckle. Then take the top part of the seat belt around the back, again putting it into the blue route guides. If you need to tilt the seat up slightly in order to fit it round, that's okay, but make sure that you place it back down securely. Then pull to tighten the seat belt to make sure it's secure the whole way around, checking that there are no twists at any point. Lastly, make sure that the handle is in the right position, and this varies for different child car seats, so check the instructions. Make sure that the buckle doesn't bend around the shell of the child car seat, as this will put pressure on it, causing it to fail in a crash. Finally, you just need to make sure that your baby's fitted in the actual seat correctly. So you want to make sure that their shoulder pads are just on their shoulder or dropping down no more than an inch. And then you want to make sure that the harness isn't too tight or too loose. You want to be able to get two fingers underneath. And also, not too thick clothes because that will stop how well they're being protected. We recommend that you keep your baby rearward facing for as long as possible. We would say until about 15 months or when they're 13 kilograms or the crown of their head which is level with the top of the seat. You can find all our information on child car seats and best buys that have been able to withstand our tough lab tests that are higher than the UK standard.